Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This week we're going to be discussing about owning an off-grid trailer after four seasons of use. It has brought us a mix of advantages and disadvantages, particularly when considering safety in various weather conditions and potentially encountering wildlife, such as bears in remote areas. Let's dive into the comparisons with other camping styles like ground or rooftop tenting. Boom! Comfort and convenience. Off-grid trailers offer more comfort and convenience compared to ground or rooftop tenting. They often come equipped with amenities like a kitchenette, shower, comfortable sleeping arrangements, and they typically offer a more home-like experience. Weather resilience. The off-grid trailer excels in weather resilience when compared to ground and rooftop tents. In the face of unexpected storms that blast us with snow, rain, or high winds, the trailer becomes a safe refuge, keeping us out of the outside elements. The off-grid trailer's ability to withstand diverse weather conditions adds a layer of safety and comfort that traditional camping methods may struggle to match. Bear Country Precautions One of the off-grid trailer's advantages becomes evident in bear country. With sturdy construction and secure doors and windows, the trailer provides a heightened sense of safety compared to traditional tents. The materials used to construct these trailers add a barrier of protection against curious wildlife and a more secure camping experience. With its reinforced structure, the off-grid trailer provides a stable and secure environment addressing safety concerns associated with varying terrains. Terrain mobility. Off-grid trailers allows the overlanding experience in the backcountry settings. However, there's a limit to where they can go. I have yet to encounter an area that I'm unable to get to. There has been a couple of times where the trailer has become stuck with proper recovery gear and the task of getting out becomes less problematic. Getting stuck is part of the fun with the backcountry explorations. The allowance of leveling and maneuvering ability of the trailer lessens the anxiety one feels when camping in unknown locations. Costs, equipment, and simplicity. The cost of owning an off-grid trailer is obviously much higher than your traditional ground and rooftop tent, but the equipment you will need to experience a comfortable stay remains the same. All of these methods require sleeping arrangements, food storage and prep, traditional camping equipment, safety gear, and so on. Minimizing is not always possible when lengthy stays are required. Simplicity is used loosely in overlanding. In my experience, the setup and takedown of the off-grid trailer can't get any easier. Close and lock the doors, hook up, and go. Maintenance is required for each method of camping. Where one style you may need to torque tires, the other may need sealant for stubborn leaks and tears. Camping requires you to stay on top of your gear no matter how you choose to do it. Okay, some of the advantages to the off-grid trailer is obviously the power generation and storage as it's all equipped into one area. We have batteries and we have an inverter and we have the solar charger. Uh, many off-grid trailers come equipped with solar panels and battery storage systems such as this, allowing for sustainable power generation even in remote areas. This enables the use of electronic devices, lighting, and other amenities without relying on external power sources. Off-grid trailers typically offer ample storage space for gear, supplies, and equipment, allowing for more extended trips without the need for frequent reloading. So owning this off-grid trailer has definitely lessened the amount of having to remember what to bring. Um, you know, in the warmer seasons, we can pack this trailer and keep it packed and resupply when we need to. But it's always, it's, it's been a noticeable change for Paul and I that we can come home, load up the trailer onto the Jeep and leave. The storage is great for storing blankets, clothes, um, your bathroom supplies, anything that you need in immediate uh, service through the night. 
is nice to have. In conclusion, the off-grid trailer not only offers a unique and flexible camping experience, but also stands out as a safer option in bare country and challenging weather conditions. And we love it. Um, ooh, like shit. Okay, hold on. <laughs> you gotta do that entry <laughs> over. You're looking over at someone. Okay. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. This week we're talking about owning an off-grid trailer after four seasons of use. <laughs> Shut up. Dog is barking. Oh my god. One more time. Okay. One more time yeah. for real. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This week we're going to be discussing about owning an off grid trailer after four seasons of use. It has brought us a mix of advantages and disadvantages, particularly when considering safety in various weather conditions and potentially encountering wildlife, such as bears in remote areas. Let's dive into the comparisons with other camping styles like ground or rooftop tenting. Boom! 